Mrs. Smith here, and today we are reading The Very Ordinary Caterpillar, written and illustrated by Gary Fleming and published by Weldon Kids. The Very Ordinary Caterpillar. Once there was a caterpillar, a very ordinary caterpillar. He looked up one day and saw that the sky was endlessly blue. And all around him, flowers bloomed in so many colours, he could not count them. Two beautifully coloured rainbow lorikeets flew over and landed beside him. Why do you have so many beautiful colours and I do not? asked the very ordinary caterpillar. Because we are rainbow lorikeets, they laughed, and you are just a very ordinary caterpillar. Below on the forest floor, a bird with feathers that shimmered like satin was strutting about. Why do you have feathers that shine like satin? And I do not, asked the very ordinary caterpillar. Because I am a satin boa bird, he said, bowing proudly, and you are just a very ordinary caterpillar. A magnificent orange frill round his neck a lizard was sunning himself nearby. Why do you have a magnificent orange frill, and I do not? asked the very ordinary caterpillar. Because I am a frilled lizard, he hissed, flaring his frill, and you are just a very ordinary caterpillar. Just then, a big green frog with bright red eyes came hopping past the very ordinary caterpillar. Why do you have bright red eyes and I do not? asked the very ordinary caterpillar. Because I am a red-eyed frog, he croaked. And you are just a very ordinary caterpillar. Creeping out from between the leaves came an orange creature with big white spots. Why do you have so many big white spots and I do not? asked the very ordinary caterpillar. Because I am a spotted cuscus, he said, oh so slowly, and you are just a very ordinary caterpillar. I don't have shiny feathers or a magnificent orange frill. I don't have red eyes, spots or rainbow colours. I am really a very ordinary caterpillar, said the very ordinary caterpillar. And with that, he spun himself in a cocoon to hide. And that's where he stayed until one day. The cocoon began to open and he soon realised that he wasn't a very ordinary caterpillar anymore. His wings shimmered like satin with more colours than a rainbow. They were edged in orange frill and covered in white spots. And right in the middle of both wings were two bright circles that looked just like eyes. The very ordinary caterpillar was now a very extraordinary butterfly. That's all for today.